Once again, we're asked to find the points on the graph that have a horizontal tangent line, which means we're looking for the points on the graph that have a tangent line with a slope of zero. So we're going to find the derivative using the quotient rule. That would be the denominator times the derivative of the numerator, which is just a constant, so that's times zero, minus the numerator times the derivative of the denominator all over the denominator squared. And we're definitely going to simplify this. Anything times zero is just zero, so we end up with minus 14x all over the denominator squared. Remember that we're looking for points on the graph that have a horizontal tangent line, which means they have a slope of zero. So we're going to take our derivative and we're going to set it equal to zero. So here's our equation. And of course we're going to think about this as a fraction by putting it over one and then we're going to cross multiply. Zero times the denominator is just zero. Negative 14x times one is just negative 14x. And then we're going to solve for x by dividing both sides by negative 14. And zero divided by any other number is just zero. So x equals zero. So we're looking for the point on the graph of f that has that x value of zero. So we're going to plug in an x value of zero into the original function. So we get zero squared plus one which of course is just 7 divided by 1, so the y value for that point would be 7. So at 0, 7, the graph has a horizontal tangent line.